My name's Helen Geek. Um, I came to York in 1990 to do a DPhil, which I finished in 1995. Um, and I, since then, I've worked for the Portable Antiquities Scheme mainly, which records archaeological finds made by members of the public. But I also spent uh, a few years working for Time Team, which is great fun. I think York is a really amazing place to do an archaeology degree because it's absolutely stuffed full of archaeologists. It's got so many people who, who are working in different parts of the profession, um, from regulating it at Historic England to digging it up at York Archaeological Trust to, to working in policy like the um, Council for British Archaeology. So, so it's not just your department. Wonderful though it is, you've got the whole town working with you. Um, but the department is really special because it's got its own little tiny little campus at King's Manor, which is, of course, steeped in, in archaeology. And, um, and, and so it feels more like a family than it does like a part of a giant university. The value of an archaeology degree, if, you, if you're coming straight from school as a conventional undergraduate, then archaeology is a completely fantastic degree because it combines so many skills. You've got the, the, the physical skill of, of looking at uh, archaeological features and decoding them. Um, you've got the, the scientific aspects. You've got the humanities aspects. You've even got artistic aspects if you're interested in, um, in, in displaying and, uh, and interpreting the results to the public. It, or everything is within there. Now, if you, if you decide that you want to come to archaeology later in life as a mature student, of course, you can bring all those skills that you've got from life um, to archaeology, because archaeology is the study of all of human life in the past, and therefore nothing is irrelevant. But the, the great thing about archaeology is that it, it fits you for so many different jobs. Um, and although I've spent my working life within archaeology, uh, my hobby at the moment is politics. I've, I've been standing for Parliament for the last two elections, and I've now got myself elected to my local district council. And you would not believe how many politicians started off with an archaeology degree, because it's great for people who are interested in, in people, and it's great for people who are interested in change, because it's all about how things can change. They don't have to stay the same. We see that change over so many years, and we can make it happen now.